four lock yo. I love four lock yo. I bo kilo re in the Kissy kissy casa 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 planka. I open Bible chapter. I step on the Satan. Anytime I knock, I knock with that No rubber band, no rubber band Every time I put down, they show me that If I know too loud, she got my back I do you who, I'm happy that I do you who, say everything I do is for my woman Anything I talk, when you talk, I go do one Me and other see another girl for my visuals Loving you, loving you, now in my ritual Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Today is Friday. It's the 30th of June. Uh, it's the day before my birthday. My birthday is tomorrow, 1st of July. If you know anything about me, you know that I absolutely dread my birthday. And yeah, today is just one of those days. Like I'm just like, I want tomorrow to happen and pass. And for years now, I'm struggling to put my finger on what is the reason I feel like this on my birthday because I can't put my finger to it. I'm even shaking talking about it. Sorry. Sorry. So I'm just like, I don't know what it is. I can't put my finger on it, but it happens, you know. I'm doing my morning routine, my skincare routine. I'm using my Porsche M. Um. So yeah, um, I just washed my face. Uh, damn just doing my morning routine and yeah guys like i'm just today i'm just planning on it's 10 25 minutes past 10. um i don't really have much planned out i don't have any plans for my birthday also because i don't usually plan anything for my birthday guys my birthday makes me so tired like <laughs> my it's tired i just mean like what i just said see I don't know what it is, like, I don't know what it is, but my birthday just, like, I don't know, it exhausts me, like, the thought of it, the, 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 the thought of it being my birthday, the thought of it, I don't know, I, I just don't know what it is, but it happens every single year. I remember last year, there's, there's a lady I always speak to on, on, on Instagram. And last year she inboxed me and she's like, I noticed that every year on your birthday, you talk about how your birthday is a heavy day for you. Like your heart feels burdened and you feel like, you know, you're carrying some weight. And then, sorry, she proceeded to tell me that it also used to happen to her. Um, in her 20s yeah, well in her especially in her late 20s because she's like over 30 now so she's like in her late in her late 20s she used to always feel like her birthday is like a reminder that she has not achieved what she had thought she would have achieved at that age level yeah, well, like i said i can't really pinpoint what it is that makes me feel like this like i can't pinpoint why do I feel so burdened on my birthday? Why do I feel like my heart is heavy? Why do I always feel like I want it to happen and pass? You know, I can't pinpoint. But she told me that, and I was like, maybe that's the reason. Maybe that's why I feel how I feel too. You know, but maybe I just can't put it in words. It's just like, no, take it easy. You're probably reflecting on your life, and you're like, 
I'm not where I was. I wanted to be at this age or I haven't achieved what I wanted to achieve at this age. But the thing is, I don't really complain on my birthday. Like, you're not going to hear me complain. No, hear, 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 what, 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 no. I just, like, don't want to participate in the day, that day. <laughs> That's just what be happening, you know. And it's, like, for the past, I don't know how many years. I don't know when last did I look forward to my birthday. You saw how I was so excited for my man's birthday. Like, it felt like I'm so excited. And he's the one that really instilled that thing of being happy about birthdays. But I can't pull myself towards being happy for my birthday. I'm always happy to celebrate his birthday or anyone else for that matter. But my birthday, mm -mm. <laughs> you know, so yeah, it's just that. Uh, I got my nails done this week. Got my nails done this week by a lady, you know, just to try and pick myself up or whatever. But my man is out of town, so I'm not sure what's gonna happen. I think that's another thing that weighs in heavy on my heart, Wuti. Like every year, he's never around. Like before my birthday, he only arrives on my birthday. Last year, he he flew in the morning of my birthday. Like I woke up and there's this man in my bedroom. I'm like, excuse me. Why don't you call? What if I was with someone? <laughs> you know, like we are telling and she push. To do and and you know, um, but I was just obviously playing around. Um, yeah, he just telling that, you know, on my on my birthday in the morning of my birthday, and he spent I think he spent a week with me. Then he went back, um, you know, and the year before that, just twenty twenty one, he was around, but he left. He left two days after my birthday. Oh, I wanted to die. And this year, today, is the day before my birthday and he's not here and I'm absolutely not coping, like I'm not coping. Then, yeah, I don't know, I don't know what to feel and how to act because of Jay, you know? Guys, by the way, this wig, right, this wig is the wig that I wear that is curls. I washed it and I straightened it and I wore it. Like I've had it on for two days now. Yeah, come on, come on. I need to take it out. I've had it on for two days now. Can you see how few it looks? And this is it when it's straight. And then the only thing I do is I put on those red rollers um, to get those curls. And then, yeah. And people don't believe me when I tell them that. I'm like, I even have a video on my on my YouTube to show that that's really what I do. Like. I really just, I curl it myself and that's how I'm able to achieve those curls. So yeah, but I'm, I'm gonna take it out because tomorrow I want to wear my long wig. I want to wear my long wig. So that's what I'm gonna do guys. I'm just gonna go straight in my long wig. That's what I'm gonna do today. Today I don't really have plans. And yeah, I don't really have plans. I'm going to go and straighten my long wig. I need to take this wig off. It's even eating me by the ears here. Like... It's so painful. Damn. I need to take this wig off. It's literally hanging on my ears now. So I did my child, so I need to take it off. But before I do that, I'm just going to go to the lounge and then I'm going to straighten my hair. Guys, I'm grateful for life. Like, don't get me wrong. Don't think that me like not being excited for my birthday means that I don't want to live or something. <laughs> I'm very grateful for life and I'm very grateful to God for blessings. You know, a grateful heart is a magnet for blessing, miracle, grace, mercy, favor. I'm absolutely grateful for life. I'm happy that I have a roof over my head. I've got food in my stomach, clothes in my, on my back. I'm grateful for a whole lot of things I've got caring parents i've got a caring partner i'm very grateful for all those things you know i just feel like my birthday though i'm really really grateful um this past week i started working with avon um, on the brand influence challenge which is a seven day challenge and this is a product we're working with but 
I've incorporated these products in my night uh, skincare routine. I'm not using them during the day because during the day I use sunscreen. So, and I use my Kosha M eye cream. I use these, um, well, I'm, I'm testing these out and I've incorporated them in my night skincare routine. You see, there's a lot of things to be grateful for, you know. I know this is not a big thing, that's a small thing, but for me, it means a lot. It means a lot that I could be picked out of millions and millions of people that, you know, could have been picked. I'm, I'm very grateful. <clears throat> I'm very, very happy. And yeah, I shot, I shot um, the, the promo video for those things yesterday, last night. I did it like around 11 o'clock. I was busy in here and I shot, um, the video and everything just to introduce the project that i'm working on with avon and i'm grateful you know it's i'm i'm, I'm extremely grateful i am absolutely grateful you know so yeah i've been rambling and i've been going on and on and on and on i'll see you guys a bit later this is a brand new vlog by the way so yeah let's vlog Relax, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I get really good, but I'm just a, I'm just a. It's all like a mental. 
Props. I can't wait for like something to show that it was the party. You don't need props. You're already wearing a beret, so. Today, hi, it's the second um, of July. Uh, I'm trying to make my Sunday dish. I want to make it now in the morning so I know that in the afternoon um, my food will be ready for me to eat. Because, yeah, so I've got what do you call this? I had bought a pumpkin, yeah, but I bought a pumpkin, and then the pumpkin, yeah, me was being like it was you know the half one it was too much so then i had to cut it in half then i cooked the other half during the week so i'm gonna cook this half now okay yeah it's still fine it's still fine i'm gonna cook the other half now today and yeah man I'm making oxtail. I'm gonna make breakfast. My beetroot is already in the pot. I cook beetroot with my hot pots because I feel like, um, it. You know when you boil the beetroot, most that water stains the pots. So in these checkers pots, I always find it difficult to wash it off. So I use hot pots to do that. I'm gonna also make breakfast, but first I need to put my oxtail. Oh, sorry. <clears throat> I need to put my yo, I need to put my oxtail 
on the stove. I don't know if you guys can you see me. Yes, I'm putting on anything else but me. Like I hope you guys can see me. My birthday was okay, guys. My birthday was okay. Thank you so much for the birthday wishes. You know, ne, let me tell you guys one thing. It's something for someone to say happy birthday and you know, um reshare your picture or whatever. Like that takes an effort, guys. That that takes an effort and then the DMs. Like you guys really, really like me and I like that and I really appreciate that. I really appreciate it. The people that get me the most are the ones that put music with my picture. I'm just like, you know, that's an effort right there. And wow, just wow. I really, really appreciate it. Like from the bottom of my heart, from like the bottom of my heart, I really appreciate it. I'm like, these people really F with me like that. Like you guys talk with me, you know. And like I said, my birthday is not my favorite day of the, of the year. Um, I choose to like not really participate in my birthday. Yesterday, I just I woke up and ooh, this is too loud. <laughs> yeah, I think it's too loud. Anyway, yeah. So I woke up and I I have a friend of mine whose birthday is also on the first of July, and she lost her mom in twenty twenty one. Yeah, well. So she reached out to me like a week ago and she asked me because like I said I'm very vocal about the fact that I don't participate in my birthday like I lock myself in the house I'll see you guys tomorrow like I'll see you guys you see today I'm up today I'm up like you, know, you see how I was on Friday I was doing my hair playing music doing my praise and worship guys one thing about me Nay, I will blast this radio and I'll listen to gospel like <laughs> you know, so yeah, um, she called me up like two weeks ago and she told me that um, She asked me she's like to me She's my friend from primary. She's like um, How do you deal with you know this thing of our tiny bit there? Cause like you're not excited about it for your birthday. I'm like babe. I just sit in the house like, I just sit in the house, you know, if, if my boyfriend is not around honestly there's nothing else I do. I just literally sit in the house. Quite literally, that's what I do. You know? Let's wash some oxtail, guys. Wait, I'm not going to go now. You need oxtail. I'm just camera. This, how is this tripod also? Oh, mom. Oh, give me. She need you. Yay. Now, wow. Now, how well for you? How are you standing here? I bo. Hey, 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 guys. I'm full of music by my state. I'm a state. I'm full of jukun. Come, good things. Yeah, but but man, you know, you try for that full operator. Let me try from the angle. Hopefully, it shows. Yeah, that's fine. So guys, she asked me, Uti, sorry, oh god, I hope you guys can see me, hey? So then she asked me, how do I deal with that? I was like, friend, I just sit in the house, baby, and lock myself up. Like, the only person that can get me out of my house would honestly be my boyfriend if he is serious about it, you know? <laughs> if he puts his mind to getting me out the house, he can succeed, you know? Ooh, ooh, he can succeed, you know? Other than that, mm -mm. I'm from Ubana next. I'm from Ubana Mundo. I'm from Ubana next. Like, I just want to be alone. Here's my art tail. I'm going to put in. It's like, man, that's one thing about me and salt. Hey, good guys. Hey, good guys. Hold to that. I was like, friend, listen. One was forced, eh? Mama as you guys are something in my head. If you don't feel like going out, don't do it. If you don't feel like dressing up, don't do it. Don't do anything you don't feel like doing because that's going to ruin your birthday. You're going to be like, hmm, you know. 
So yeah, yesterday Palisa came. Bless Palisa's heart. I love that girl to bits. She came. She tried. Hey, she came. Um. Bayam Patele Ike, cause she came with cake. She bought me wine. Oh, bless Palisa, guys. Bless Palisa. And she's like, friend, let's go out. I was like, yeah. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> She's like, no, let's go out. I want to take you out for your birthday. You look so pretty. Because I've done my face and everything. You know, I was just sitting indoors. I was like, I did my face because I feel happier when I look pretty. Like, I could be depressed and ready to kill myself, guys. But if I've got makeup on, I'm going to be such a beautiful corpse. You get So, okay, okay, okay. I was like, friend, no, man. No, man. Not what I intended to do today. I don't want to go out. I think I think I want to sit indoors, you know, and she chilled with me for a little bit and we had a slice of cake. But I couldn't be asked to pick up my phone and record, guys, because just like I said, you know, the langa, the heavy man. The heavy langa, man. But yeah, anyways, yeah. I spent most of the day alone. Like, I spent the whole day alone in the chauffeur because first I came like, in the evening around 6 p.m. ish and she's chilled with me for an hour she was feeling tired too so she's like she's just gonna go home and rest she's got church today and i was like i'll probably also go to church but i woke up this morning and nothing in me said go to church please something in me though said cook yourself a bomb as meal like like cook like, I, I felt like I want to romanticize myself the way I romanticize my man. So, you know, when my man is here, I've got so much energy to cook for him. Like, I can literally, I can, I can slaughter a sheep for that guy, do you get? <laughs> so, I was like, I want to give myself the same energy today, you know, just to say, happy birthday, Gamza. You know what I mean? So, yeah, man. Um, that's just that guys. I've got absolutely nothing else planned. I'm just gonna be indoors uh, cooking um, I'm making pumpkin oxtail. I'm gonna make dumplings as well. No, not dumplings e e
like it's not bad it's not really bad honestly speaking it's not bad it's okay yeah guys hey i've been rambling telling you all my stories i'll catch up with you guys during the day or throughout the day but like there's nothing more i'm doing i'm just cooking and yeah um also guys can i ask for a small favor and then i know it's a lot i know it's a lot but i'm just gonna humbly plead with you guys right i absolutely appreciate the dms and the comments you know but like when i look at it i'm like hey well the video i uploaded has like 600 views right but it's got like four likes but my dms are flooded like my dms are flooded i enjoyed the vlog consistency is nice where did you get the top what 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 you know what i mean and i'm like i want to say thank you please comment on the on the thingy on the video itself on youtube you know but i'm like no maybe let me rather put it in a video like as i'm speaking to you right now let me rather do it like this you know instead of like saying that to you like when you dm me because I find that it happens a lot. Like my, my my the video will have like two comments and three likes, but there's 600 views, you know. And obviously, the 600 views are equivalent to the subscribers because the subscribers are at six at the moment. I think it's 655. So if it's 600 views, yeah, who you know, it's telling, you know. But the likes, it's like two likes. I'm like, oh, but you guys, you don't like it. <laughs> like you guys you don't like it you know and then i get the dm and it's like i really enjoyed the vlog i'm like please please uh thingy please comment on the vlog itself it means a lot to me when you comment on the vlog itself you know so that i i can see that there's engagement and that's really just it you know that's all i'm, I'm humbly asking i know it's a lot because you know i know some people prefer to dm me you know which is also fine because i do respond to dms guys if you say i don't respond to your dm you're lying i'm not that busy oh i'm not that busy if i'm busy i'll return it don't worry no no i lie i will return there's no way i'm not gonna respond i respond to dms i do i do i respond to dms i respond to comments i do all the time you know so if i don't do it immediately trust me i will do it then yeah, well, so I was just humbly, humbly asking, like my humblest plea. Please like my videos. <laughs> Please comment on the actual video. Please DM me as well if you like. If you feel Uwuti, uh, she wants a lot, I must DM her and I just say, just comment on the video, it's fine. You don't have to DM me. But if you feel you'd rather DM me, that's fine. But I would highly, highly request that. Please comment on the actual video and yeah man yeah man that's just it hey <laughs> that's just it i'm having coke i'm not having papalas that spear was actually good i'm quite i don't have a headache i don't have papalas i finished the whole bottle and i'm still fine Ooh. i'm still fine but obviously you know that alcohol dehydrates you, so I'm definitely feeling dehydrated and I feel like I'm full of water, so that's why I'm full of coke and send So yeah, guys, um, I'm going to properly end the vlog probably later on in the day just to show you my final meal. Um, I don't really like to take you through what I'm cooking because I've already explained it and this is stuff that I've probably cooked before on the channel, so yeah, man. Uh, like cutting it like this like oh my god oh my god <laughs> yeah so and this pumpkin is actually bought by my man i mean i i buy the ones that are already chopped from chickens like they're already chopped so i don't have to go through this but this one was bought by my man's because i had sent him to buy me a pumpkin and bless his heart he did not know what to buy and he Settled for this one, which is hard labor. So yeah. So the Kuluma, you guys. I hope your Sunday is going well. My Sunday is definitely gonna be fine, child. It's gonna be fine when this food it be labor right to get Sunday, and then I'm able to eat. For now, I'm just gonna 
Yeah. I'll just see you later. <laughs> Hey well guys, I wanted to show you Uguti, my dumplings came, my, well my steamed bread came out so nice. I was so scared now because I'm alone, right? And I didn't want to make a lot. Like I just wanted it to be as small as it is right now because new one, you know, and I don't want it to be, like the longest I can eat steamed bread is two days. Like I don't want to be having the steamed bread after three, four days. No, it's not going to taste nice. I can have it tonight, right? Sorry, I'm going to have it tonight. Then... I'm gonna have it tomorrow again that's it like maybe tomorrow morning ish or in the afternoon not in the evening you know so i was just like so it's just like no man um it came the size is exactly how i want i would want it to be i'm just gonna obviously slice it because this is how i enjoy eating dumbbell lamb i don't put it in cups and stuff i enjoy it my leaves will cut and where my slices and then I'll have it with my food. Everything I'll save with you guys. I just wanted to show you this because it's such a proud moment for me. Uti. I was so scared and I was thinking, because guys, one thing about me, I do not take measurements seriously because I'm not a professional chef or anything. So I just measure with my eyes. I'm so sorry. I will pour three cups and I'll pour yeast. The one that like I'd pour the amount that I think is sufficient or enough. I don't have any regards to actual strict measurements, you know. So I thought it was put my evening. I thought it's gonna be a lot, and I was like, "Yo, the last thing I need is to waste or to have this thing evening, and then it it spoils." Like it's normal. I'm like, I'm so proud, but I'm not hungry right now because I just drank Coke, guys. I am so dehydrated. I'm so dehydrated. Literally, I just drank Coke, and I feel like I'm full because of the acid or whatever. So yeah, I'm not gonna eat now. It's four o'clock right now. Um, it's 4 p.m. I'm probably gonna eat my six because I like for the food to yeah, By the time you're lala, at least I know that I'm not gonna feel like I'm too full or whatever. So I have like my dinner at six o'clock, and yeah, that's just that. That's just that. I'm actually on the couch, I'm watching on TT on YouTube, and that's basically it. That's it. That's it. That's it. I'll see you guys like later when I dish up for my dinner. Let me take the first bite. I haven't tasted anything here. And I'm really, really so hungry. This food is good. I obviously have my, my ring light on because it's dark here and six up so much. I said I'm gonna eat at six, but I think it's like seven ish. Um so yeah. Mm, the chakalaka, I'm so sorry. The oxtail is off the bone. Like guys, what can't I do? Like I don't know send me a list of things that you think i can't do let me try and prove you wrong all right because what is this cooking like mm. Mm. this is great eh? This is so, so great. I love it. <clears throat> I absolutely love it. Mm.
Oh. Sorry. <laughs> Woo! Sorry. It wraps up this weekend. I, I think my heart is full of gratitude more than anything. Um, like I said on Friday, like I'll keep on saying, I'm so grateful. I'm really grateful. I'm really happy. I'm grateful. My heart is full. And yeah. <sighs> With that being said, guys, thank you so much. If you've made it to this part of the vlog, thank you. I appreciate it, guys. Please comment on the video, this video. You see this video that you are watching right now, Nim. Please comment on this video. Please like this video. Please share this video. You can also DM me. Like I said earlier on, I don't mind the DM. But I, like I would highly appreciate if it's this video that you interact with. Because this is where I can see if there's engagement or not. Because my DMs, yeah, I can see that there's engagement. And I appreciate that too. Like I said, it's a lot of effort for me to ask you to, okay, leave the video, go to my DM. Then after my DM, come back to the video and comment on the video, you know. All I'm asking just, with the humblest plea, can you please like this video? And all my other videos moving forward. And can you please comment on the video this one and all the other videos that i'm gonna upload moving forward as the queen of consistency we'll meet again on thursday thank you guys so much god bless you and bye